guys, we go for a walk to our local park. It is in the suburbs of our town. Hello guys and welcome to different Russia channel. The 8th of March, uh, Women's Day. So we would like to uh, wish all the women in the world uh, a lot of health and be in a good mood. Yeah, Alex? Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, congratulations. Yeah. So, uh, we go for a small walk. Uh, unfortunately, our plans have changed just a little bit because Alex needs to go to his office. So, we will walk in the park, then Alex will go to Moscow and I will go back home. Uh, but hope that the walk will be uh, rather nice. Uh, we would like to invite you to our um, local park. That is um, the only city park that we have in our town. Let's go! <laughs> Unfortunately, guys, the loud music is playing. That was a small cafe, Fox. <laughs> uh, a cup of coffee is about one American dollar. Uh, different prices, one dollar up to one and a half American dollars. Yeah. They have the ski track, uh, the bicycle track. Yeah. Now, guys, all the activities that we have in our city, they are mostly here, in this park. Живопись в парке. О, мастер-класс. So guys, that is the timetable of the activities for one week. So they have something every day. For example, on Thursday they have some kind of painting class. Живопись в парке. So maybe I will go to have a look. The small cafe, but at the moment it is some craft zone. They have master classes here, mostly for kids, of course. And as we are rather late today, everything is over, yeah, Alex. Yeah. We can only enjoy the nature. In summertime, of course, it looks different, but in winter, also not bad. Though today is rather cold and rather grey sky. They even promised minus 20 during the night. Uh, hope that won't happen. <laughs> but I'm so happy that the spring has finally started. Alex, that is the first holiday of the spring, yeah? Первый mm -hmm. праздник весны. Yeah, very slippery here, guys. Very nice bird houses here in the park. One more bird house, guys, <laughs> with some seeds. Yeah. So 
Hello guys, we have explored the park a little bit. Uh, here is a very nice ski track. Uh, many benches, that is super cool, but in winter time that is of no use. Uh, a few, how is to say, buildings. Uh, at the moment they are used for some, I don't know, master classes. So, but in summer time there should be some cafe. At the moment it is used for master classes, mostly for kids, of course. Uh, some a place where they sing songs, some concert area, yeah? Mm -hmm. What else? And uh, some sports activities, тренажерный mm зал, -hmm. yeah, some gym under the <laughs> sky <laughs> in the open air, so some uh, sport uh, ground, yeah? Mm -hmm. And that is all. Uh, as we are rather late, now it's about two o'clock, so all the fun was here at about 12 o'clock, so... But honestly, I did not want to come very early because loud music and it was difficult uh, to film. So we are somewhere at the end of the park because here no music, as YouTube has some very strict copyright rules. Everywhere on the territory of the park they have some uh, cameras, so they film everything for some safety, because here is the forest. <laughs> Alex, Alex says no squirrels, <laughs> that is very sad. So guys, and now let's talk just a little bit about the gifts that usually uh, all women get on the 8th of March, on this holiday. Uh, very traditional uh, are flowers, of course, yeah? tulips. Uh, yesterday there were flower bazaars everywhere in our uh, city, so everyone was <laughs> working with flowers. Uh, a lot of such bazaars, flower bazaars, flower shops, so very, very busy time. Also very traditional gift um, sweets, some chocolates, for example, yeah, Raffaella. yeah, Raffaella, uh, some, some candies, of course, and gift cards. Uh, every shop, um, I don't know, Litual, for example, Padrushka, uh, that is a shop where they sell cosmetics. Uh, they give such cards, uh, gift cards, yeah? and uh, they are of different value, for example, 1,000 rubles, 2,000, 3,000, 5,000, so it depends how much you would like uh, to spend. So, and such gift cards are very, very popular. I also got a gift card and we will go to Leonardo. That is uh, one of my favorite DIY stores. So I will go and choose something for my painting. Yes. Uh, Alex says uh, not only traditional uh, flower bouquets are popular, but also uh, bouquets made of uh, nuts and dry fruit. Mm -hmm. So, handmade. Handmade, yeah. <laughs> Very popular. One more bird house in the shape of a taxi. <laughs> we were given a balloon in the shape of the hut. <laughs> Oh, Alex, one more bird house. Let's oh, go. More, more, more. Yeah, a lot of them. And everywhere seeds. Sunflower seeds and other seeds. Something is written here. Zaitseva Antonina. So the girl who made this house. Uh, the first grade. School number one. So, 
kids create such bird houses. But I think those are not constructed by this girl, but maybe by her father, because here you can see very, very firm construction. As I have told guys, this park is located in the suburbs of our town, and the other side of the park, those are duchess. There is some Dutch community. Those small houses you can see in the distance. So guys, that is the end of our tour around the park. We made a big circle. Of course, it's better to come here during the summertime when it is warm. I have discovered that they have painting classes, some kind of plein air. So maybe I will go and have a look what they are doing here. Uh, so the concert is going on, but well, we decided to finish our walk today. Trip. Yeah, our trip. <laughs> so, guys, so thank you for watching. Thank you for being with us today. Uh, soon will be some more episodes. Hope the weather will improve and I can go somewhere because now it's very cold, <laughs> not very comfortable to film. So, thank you once again. Goodbye. See you soon. Пока. And happy Women's Day to all the women in the world. Пока, друзья. What is the price? Карты временно не принимаются. 100 рублей, наверное, да, вон? Ну, не знаю, нет, просто написано. Не, не работает. Не работает. Doesn't work. Wanted to know the price of the parking lot, so it doesn't work. Maybe that is for the summer time when a lot of people. And let's make this video more useful. We'll show prices on diesel. Yeah, uh -huh. <laughs> so let's go. That is the filling station, Luke Coil, a uh, rather popular brand. And the prices today, guys, diesel uh, 62.63, uh, petrol 92, that is regular, yeah, Alex? Uh, regular, uh, 50.97, uh, regular 95 petrol, 56.81, and Ecta 95, I don't know what is Ecta. So the price is 57.87. So diesel is the most expensive, yeah, Alex? Mm -hmm. Нечестно. Нечестно. When we bought our diesel car, <laughs> that was 20... 09, yeah? Mm -hmm. About 15 years ago. The price of diesel was 16 rubles, <laughs> now 62. Yeah, Alex says diesel was 16 rubles and uh, petrol, regular petrol was 20 rubles. That was 15 years ago. That is why it was one of the reasons why we decided to buy diesel car, because mm -hmm. diesel was cheaper than petrol. Thank you for the tour, Alex. <laughs> Goodbye, Alex. Yeah, and I will go here. About 30 minutes on foot and I will be at home. 
for us, of course, it's not a very good location of the park because we live in the historical center and the park is in some distance. So 30 minutes, that is too much. We cannot come here with Shafi because it's, well, it's difficult for Shafi to walk for such a long distance. Here mostly guys Khrushchevka buildings and such small cottages, the neighborhood with such one-storied buildings that looks like a village. We went here for a walk with Christina, so we filmed Ivanova Street. It looks like a village and such small, mostly five-storied buildings here in this area. That bright building, red and yellow and gray, that is kindergarten. And some graffiti on the wall. I think that is electricity box. That gray and yellow and green building, that is school number four, secondary school number four, state school. And very nice graffiti over here. Luckily, vandals did not come to spoil it.